Hi everyone, in this video I will show you how to create a Snowflake account for free. Go to snowflake.com You will find an option to create a free account. Start for free. Click on it. It will ask for some details like first name, last name, email and company. I am giving my first name as Snowpark and last name as email. Sorry, last name as user and my email is snowparkuser at gmail.com let me name company as snowflake or i'll give it as none for now and you can select i don't want to receive promotional offers it's optional for you and click on continue here you will find an option to select the account type select the account type as standard as we are using free version and you can uh, tick the checkbox on terms and conditions and select cloud provider i am selecting aws followed by region i will leave the region as default singapore one click on get started so it will ask to uh, verify so complete the verification step once we complete this verification we will get an email to confirm our account so account setup is in progress we can select some options that corresponds to us like uh, I am selecting training and personal learning it's showing that it has sent an email to me and we can see that uh, the today free snowflake trail includes 400 worth of free usage so open your email check for mail from snowflake and click to activate so once we click that we need to select the username and password so set some username and give it a password we will be using this username and password to log into our snowflake account and username has some restrictions sorry the password has some restrictions so it has to contain cap small symbol and uh, numeric click on get started it will ask you to log in i'm saving my password We can now log in with the username and password which we have set in the previous step. Once we are signed in, it will take us to the home page where we will have option to learn the basics of Snowflake. We can see Snowflake one on one here where we can learn Snowflake architecture, credits, users, editions, and more things. From the left, bar we can navigate to the user roles that are available for us we can create more user roles on grant permissions we can see worksheets here we can see some tutorial worksheets which are used to explore the data that is present in snowflakes there are no dashboards and if you see data there would be sample data that this helps in learning the basics of snowflakes snowflake we can go and create some worksheet here and write some queries to explore the sample data that is already present in snowflake we can write some select queries create tables anything from the worksheets so from the admin page we can see the number of credits that we used for running our queries and we can also create our create more warehouses in snowflake so the current warehouse is of extra small size we can create more warehouses like that we can also increase the size of the warehouse depending on the requirement once we are done we can sign out from the snowflake account and that's it for today's video thanks for watching please subscribe to my channel if you like my content